The building and construction industry is one of the biggest industry sectors in the world. But it has been lagging behind, really. As one of the biggest producers of carbon emissions, it is in the interest of the industry itself, especially in this kind of environment, to gain efficiency and productivity, which was only by 1% improved over the last 20 years. This must change. Inspired by our founder, Professor Nemechek, we've been pioneering the idea of introducing digital software solutions to the building and construction industry uh, 50 years ago already. With our modern software solutions, the customers in the building and construction industry can gain efficiency and productivity really within the, their internal processes. Hence, they can avoid cost overruns, time overruns and waste of resources. Our vision is that the building and construction industry can gain efficiency and productivity by using modern software technology. We are architects. We want to create architecture and we are creating architecture. And we are integrating that in functional buildings. We can create something for the environment, for the built environment, and with that, we want to create something new. We want to create architecture and we want to create sustainable architecture. For Nickel and Partner, the integrated design approach is very important because with a high degree of technical installations we are facing with in laboratory as well as hospital buildings, it is a challenge to actually construct those buildings. We are looking on one hand on a construction circle and then we have to look at the same time already at the deconstruction circle and make sure I use a material mix I can separate again, which I can ideally uh, bring back into its raw form to reuse it in the long term. And we can look at alternative scenarios like maybe wooden construction as well in hospital buildings instead of traditional materials. Building Information Modeling, BIM, is following the idea that all parties involved in a building and construction project can really work seamlessly with the data in real time to be more agile and have no data loss. The Gotthard Tunnel, being one of the biggest and most prestigious projects in the European construction industry over the last 20 years, was a good example of where the BIM philosophy was applied well. It was just one of the biggest construction projects with many, many parties and disciplines involved. Uh, it took almost 20 years to build. It's the longest railway tunnel in the world and the deepest traffic tunnel. And with that kind of complexity, it would be quite normal. And we know from own research that about 30% of the time spent within such a project gets used for communication and coordination amongst the different parties. For us, a smart building is an intelligent building. It's a building which uses data to act and to react. Uh, nowadays, uh, there are a lot of systems and digital systems in a building. But if a smart building wants to be really smart, it all needs to be integrated. One of the examples is BIM, which we now use to design our buildings, also to build our buildings, and afterwards uh, will help us to maintain the buildings. We can, for instance, look at meeting room reservations, which you can do from your smartphone, your laptop, or on the room display, or on other displays. And with that reservation, you can also make sure you get sandwiches, 
But on the other hand, you can use it to steer your ventilation, the lighting, the heat, etc. We now need to have a clear vision where we want to go, and that's the Shore 2050, Sustainable Real Estate 2050. And within that program, we already now have reached the 2030 goals in 2020, because we have a vision, and in everything we do, in every contract we make, we take that with us. And that proves that if you really want it, that you can do it. The more parties can work together in order to avoid the loss of data, the better it is really for the project. We at Nemechek are convinced that the building and construction industry will continue to leverage the great advantages and capabilities that modern software allows them to improve their productivity and efficiency. And we will continue by doing so also to drive the sustainability in the construction industry.